Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. First and foremost, thank you so much. I wanted to let you guys all know that I love and appreciate every single one of you. So thank you guys for coming to check me out. If you are new, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that like button, and the notification bell. That way you never miss when I upload. I upload constantly. And I'm also uh, periodically going live. So anything that is pertaining to my channel, guys, it'll always be linked down below all of my social medias how to donate to my channel how to send payment if you want to book something personal with me all of that will be linked down below all right so let's get into the readings guys but i also just really quickly want to let you know that these are always general readings so they may or may not resonate with you take what you need and leave the rest if you vibe very well with my energy and you want to book something personal like i said please do not hesitate to reach out and energy can be past present future so it could be something going on that happened in your past or it could be currently going on or it could be happening okay so with all that being said let's jump right in all right leos welcome to your energy check-in um let's see leos i'm just gonna sit for like a minute and just see if i get any channeled messages for you guys before we start so let's see I'm hearing take things slowly and I'm hearing okay so for you guys I'm hearing take things slowly don't rush because then something's gonna get messed up so I'm hearing that for a lot of you and I, I'm getting that it's in regards it could be love and it could be actually career as well I'm getting a mix of both I'm getting like a couple different energies so slowing down because you're gonna mess something up and you don't want to do that. Um, I'm getting that there'll be like a mistake that you make. You know, it could be maybe um, in, re in regards to relationships. I'm getting that you'll come on too strong and the person will get scared and then you're going to miss an opportunity. For those of you who this resonates for in regards to like career or business, I'm getting that if you jump the gun and something goes wrong, you're going to end up screwing yourself in the long run, right? So I'm just hearing slow down to be able to catch the mistakes before they occur. All right, so Leo, let's see. What else for you guys? What else for you guys? I swear to God, I don't even know what the... I don't know if that's makeup or what. Anyway. Let's see. What else for my Leos? Wow, okay. See, those just completely flew out for you guys. Do you see what I mean by take it slow now? You see how fast the cards are coming out for you guys? That's how fast you guys are going and that, like, it's literally gonna start fucking things up so i see you know it's funny because even just with the colors and everything like that that pop out at me like i see that you guys have had a little bit of a hard time um recently right but you guys have like so you guys have okay so a lot of you and i'm getting this for like a lot of you a very big a heavy amount of you there was most likely like a really bad breakup here or there was a bad business deal Something like that. Because like I said, there's like very 50-50 energy here with you guys. Because um, a lot of you are thinking about love, but then half of you are thinking about like career. So there's like a mix of energy here. Just know this, Leos. You are loved. You know, like whether you feel like somebody's against you or not, just know that they do have genuine love for you. That's not the case. And that's not ever the case when it comes to you guys. It's just that uh, like some people take it a little too strong, right? A lot of things like, and I always say it's in the way that we deliver something rather than what we actually say. Okay. So just be mindful of that. Now, a lot of you guys have been like venting to friends or family or like anybody that will listen. A lot of you guys have been like venting about, a, like I said, a situation for some of you, it's love for some of you, it's this career thing, right? Like a bad deal or or feeling like you're not going to get anywhere with career, something like that, right? Now, you've been obsessing about it, which has been bringing it more into your life, okay? And then the fact that you keep thinking stuff when you shouldn't be thinking things, it's like it's making it worse for yourself because of the obsessing. You understand what I'm saying? Because you got it right here. It says don't talk to anybody, don't look at anybody. Like you've been going through a lot of stuff. You need time alone. You need time to reflect, retreat. So a lot of you have probably retreated from people because you know that you're in an angry mode or you know you're just f this f that right and then don't believe every shitty thought that you have they could be sneaky uh, sneaky line bastards that's what i'm saying and look you are loved right you're here for a reason don't fuck it up okay it's all about your delivery ask an expert don't rely on friends or internet ask a professional and then just stop obsessing 
stop obsessing, right? Literally here, everything we've been saying, like literally here. So for those of you who are going through that really, really bad breakup, I'm telling you right now, it will get better. It always seems worse to you guys than it really is eventually because eventually you're like, oh, fuck it, I don't care, right? Like eventually you get over something so quickly, but it's just that you take the takedown so roughly that that's what happens. That's what ends up happening, you know? Let's see what else. What else? What else? What else? Oh, that's right. I was going to grab from these. So let's see. Let's see what else for my Leos. Let's see. What should my Leos be doing at this time to help them kind of maneuver through this energy? Let's see. Let's see, Leos. What else? Yeah, see? What did I say? Look, at drop the excuses. Like, they're saying stop obsessing, right? Like, drop the excuses and just get to it. Because you guys are better than that, for sure. A lot of you still have not created, like, your sacred space. Some of you are dealing because of the... Some of you haven't because it's almost like you struggle with that spiritual versus religion aspect of things. But some of you have just been lazy not to do it. I'm Hello? Obviously, I'm going to say it like it is, right? Some of you have been lazy not to do it. Like, you've been putting it off. I see your place being chaotic. I see a lot of your places, like, being very chaotic. Like, I see towels thrown or, like, a blanket thrown somewhere on the chair or whatever. Like, or, like, a pile of laundry still not put away. Like, I see a lot of chaos in your life right now. And it's because you've retreated and done all this. But now it's time to get out of that chaos to bring yourselves out and really create a sacred space for yourself so you can set your intentions it's funny because a lot of you are very like spiritual as well in the aspect of like you know good things will come to me if i think good things or whatever but it's like you're not putting it into practice because you're allowing the the rejection or the sadness you're allowing that to take over but not realizing that you're a fire sign so literally you could like push yourselves to not feel that way fake the funk so to speak and then eventually everything catches up to each other all right leo so let's see Let's end with a mindful message for you guys. Definitely clean up your area. I'm hearing for a lot of you, definitely clean up your area. <laughs> Let's see. All right, so you guys got um, unlimited, you see? So I create my reality with the thoughts I think and things I focus on. I am unlimited in my ability to create a beautiful life full of good and love. Didn't I just say that? I just said that you guys are so all about like, oh yeah, if I think, didn't I just say that? I can't. Anyway, that's what I have for you guys, Leos. Um, don't forget to let me know if it resonates. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.